Welcome to another exciting episode of Information Nigeria Trending News. Our focus today is on how the jailbreaks in Edo Undo happened. Jailbreaks and vandalization of properties were during to be reported in some parts of the country due to the civil unrest that has enveloped the entire country. The first prison break recorded during the week was in Edo State. Video footages showed the disturbing moment some inmates escaped from Oko Correctional Facility in Bini City, Edo State, on Monday, October 19, 2020. The inmate had successfully scaled the prison wall. Information Nigeria understands that some hoodlums broke into Bini Prison, popularly called the White House, during the hashtag NSAS protest in the state. The federal government said that a total of 1,993 inmates in legal custody were freed as a result of the jailbreak in Bini City and Oko. This was disclosed in a statement issued by the ministry's director, Press and Public Relations, Mohamed Manga, on Tuesday. Nigerians, however, are taken to Twitter and other social media platforms to express shock at the jailbreak in Edo. Reports making the rounds suggest that hoodlums or hashtag enters protesters were responsible for their release. Nigerians think this is an inside connivance on the part of prison officials as an effort for the government to release military men to restore order in the country and stop the protest forcefully. It is against this background that the state governor, Godwin Obaseki, swiftly imposed a 24-hour curfew on the state. In a similar event that played out, jailbreak occurred in Ondo State on Thursday, October 22nd. Not less than 58 inmates at the National Correctional Service Center in Okitikupa, Ondo State, escaped during the prison break. This came after a 24-hour curfew was put in place by Ondo State Governor Rotimi Akeridulu. Information Nigeria gathered that scores of hoodlums defied the 24-hour curfew on Thursday to break into the center and set the inmates free. In another related incident, angry youth attacked the Ikoi Correctional Center on Thursday and set the place on fire during an attempted jailbreak. A video circulating online showed smoke coming from part of the facility. It was, however, learned that security operatives arrived at the correctional facility and they fought the attempted jailbreak. This is the season of prison break in Nigeria. Do you think the nationwide and South protest has anything to do with this incident? Share your thoughts with us and follow us on all our social media handles. Charlie, go. Two sixty. Since two sixty, what do you do? I'm not doing anything. I found my default for village. What they call arrest me, president? They call arrest. They put allegation for me. I say I keep it. I'm okay. I not do anything. Now they put me for sixty now. No court, nothing, nothing. Now I'm in the suburb, they can't visit. Today you are free. Now be near you, that's the way you go. Say thank you. Thank you. Say thank you. Yeah, you be- <laughs> we don't scatter up. Uh, we don't free prisoners, so boys don't burn. 
Prisoners out! 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 Pr